Hello everyone, welcome today to the topic sleep. How I can improve my sleeping, what I can do. And so we just start with the bad things, let it be. Then it doesn't fix the problem and this is sleeping pills. Sleeping pills is so bad. Like very seldom it maybe can help us in a moment but this doesn't fix the ground problem so we have to fix the ground problem and that is can have many reasons so huh so i give you today a little bit input what you can do for improve your sleep so first let be the sleeping pills when you take and then next coffee coffee sugar reduce this so much as possible and yeah, so when you really enjoy coffee, then drink more in the morning, not so often in the afternoon, and especially not in the evening. Then the caffeine push us, and then uh, we don't can sleep anymore. So I recommend more tea, like green tea for the morning. So also have a very good effect with the pain, but this makes more slow up. Keep it longer and go slow down. And the coffee makes pam and fast down. Fast up, fast down. Then the next coffee and the next. So we get out of balance and the tea makes more in a slow move. So it support us more in the stay in the balance. Huh? So I recommend tea. But green tea in the evening also not, then you have tea in. So in the evening when you want to drink something warm, maybe drink uh, all the tea without tea in like especially like yeah mint or just warm water whatever is uh, a lot better then uh, the other thing is like alcohol is also not the best huh? it's a poison and the body have to clean it up in the night and when you have to clean up the poison is uh, disrupt our sleep so we have not really a good sleep we don't come very in the deep sleep yeah, that's that's the problem, huh? And about drinking, then we go to food, and with food, after dinner, stop with the snacks. When you take snacks, then direct after dinner, directly after dinner, and not like one, two hour later. Then when we have a lot in the stomach, again, our system have to work, and we have a less good sleep. So let the snacks be in the evening, huh? That's the that's the next thing. So, yeah, we do, uh, we go to the general things like they recommend like six to eight hours sleep is perfect. I really can say for myself, yeah, it's matching something, but this have many other things that comes together. So maybe you need more or less sleep, but uh, this is with all things what you do in the day and under the week. So. Yeah, some people need more or some people less. But in general, like six to eight hours is, is not so bad. Yeah, then uh, the next thing is uh, the around, uh, room temperature should be between 16 to 20 degrees. Around 18, they say, is perfect. But uh, our body gets also used, uh, used to it to other temperature, especially when it's every time the same temperature. Huh? And yeah. So open the window, let a let little bit fresh air in or go to the balcony or go for a walk. That is also very good. And for the bedroom, take all electric things out or just turn it off. And the phone, put in flight modus, airplane mode. And this may be a half hour or hour before. Then uh, this can improve a lot our sleep then we can clean up the mind and don't get new information. Huh? And what do you do in this time, half hour, hour, turn uh, down the light, that you just have a little bit light and make some movements. Make, you can also make a little workout that your body get tired, like uh, push up, squat, or you also can do like Qigong, yoga, or the best is meditation, this bring you down in a relaxation and in a deep state and then you easy can go to sleep. Huh? So this is very perfect. Yeah, and 
I think more or less this is all. Just like one thing when you go to bed, lie in the bed and before maybe make some movements when you have cold that your body is warm and that you can heat up the bed by yourself with the body temperature that is perfect and then go in one position and hold this position your favorite sleeping position go in this position and breathe relax and then just wait and you will fall in sleep when you have a time move around you never go and when it's uh, itchy or so <laughs> don't don't uh, crutch just let it be huh just let it be then we can fall in sleep yeah that's the ground thing and for everyone have also other uh, favorite sleeping position for me is on the back I have more lucid dream like I be more aware in my dreams and I remember in the morning when I lie on the side or on the stomach I can fall faster in sleep but then uh, I less remembering in the morning but this is also a whole training with dreams and so on but this I think is other topic so when you have some other good uh, tips tricks whatever write in the comment and then see you next week Boom.